Uh, my name is Tyler Southern, and I was a corporal in the United States Marine Corps. He was deployed to Afghanistan <sighs> when life took a dramatic turn. May 5, 2010, stepped on 10 pounds of homemade explosives. Medics and doctors fought hard to keep him alive. They lost count at 160 units of blood. My lungs collapsed in the double digits. I flatlined in the double digits. The improvised explosive device blew off Southern's legs and right arm. His left arm is disfigured. Southern's had 31 surgeries, but through it all... I, I remember just doing kind of a... Well, that sucks. <laughs> just like... Southern stayed optimistic and positive, and he's got one infectious laugh. <laughs> Southern doesn't see the struggles. He will tell you life is good. He married his high school friend. She was one of the most beautiful things in that darn school and has ever been there, period. And I had a crush on her. Two, two three, three, four. four. They five. have two children. Marine Corps. Simper Fi. Marine Corps. <laughs> Tyler Southern gets around in a wheelchair with no trouble, but soon his mobility is about to kick into high gear with a lot of rumble and muscle. Soon, he will feel the open road in his face. This is a true American hero. Justin Von Metal owns a custom motorcycle shop in Reno. He heard about Southern's story last year at the Sturgis Motorcycle Rally in South Dakota. I just couldn't say no. I mean, it's everything about it is just inspirational to get him back on the trike and get him riding again. Southern grew up around motorcycles. His parents both rode, and so did he. There is a tranquility and there's this, an odd stillness about riding that I do indeed miss. Southern was briefly back on a bike for his homecoming to Jacksonville, Florida in 2010. It's the most crazy widespread showing of love that I've ever experienced and I probably will ever experience. Von Metal knows how important a motorcycle would be for Southern. You don't understand the amount of freedom that you get when you get to get on the open road and get the wind in your face. He's agreed to build him a custom trike so Southern can ride again. Bring it on, let's do this. Von Metal knows how to customize a bike, but this one is different. The biggest challenge is keeping him saddled into the bike and being able to maneuver due to the fact that he's only got his left arm and three workable fingers. The Black Hills, South Dakota Harley Davidson shop gave Von Metal a good deal on a 1999 Harley trike. Von Metal is raising money through a GoFundMe account to pay for the bike pickup and parts. We need the community to come together. To, we need to help to generate $35,000. We're donating shop time. We're donating all the mechanical work, all the paint, um, every, all the fab work. Von Metal will rebuild the bike to Southern's abilities. The bike is expected to be done and given to Southern at the Sturgis Rally this August. The dream's coming true. In Reno, Kim Burroughs reporting.